Okay, welcome back to my video or my channel. We'll be playing Holo Cure again. This is my this is my current progress after playing after posting that one video. I got so addicted to the to the game, and I did some a lot of troubleshootings to improve the frame rate for the game. I did a lot of recordings already of this game, but it seems that there is always a problem for me running this kind of game, since my PC isn't that fast, so it suffers quite a bit of frame FPS drops. But anyway, for now, this is all the upgrades that I got. As you can see, it isn't it, it isn't much because I spent quite a lot of I, of a lot of my holo coins for the gut the gacha mechanics of this game. And as you can see, I managed to unlock almost everything. I'm just missing that one blue haired girl. But for now, I'll be showcasing the endless mode. And I'll be using the ob broken operator that I managed to found, Nanashi Mumei. I don't know about the other, the last character that I'm missing, but for me, I found Nanashi Mumei so broken because she can basically clear the stage mode for only using his own weapon and using a lot of passives. For now, let's do this. Let's go towards the endless mode. As you can see, the game is very slow and probably I'm gonna do it times two for um times 1.5 forward for this game for now I will just keep on trying and explaining some of stuffs basically I managed to get all of the collabs I think so unless I'm missing some stuff this is the progress that I made after playing this game for an indefinite amount of time I already put uh, what you call this Nvidia layered for this one Compared to the pre first previous videos that I made, the game was very slow back then. I thought it was the character, but I re but after doing uh, the second recording for this game, I noticed that, yep, my FPS really is really dropping. And after putting the NVG overlay, I managed to speed up the game for quite a bit. And I also run this um run as a manager. I don't know if that helps me out, but if does if it improves my gameplay, then that's good for enough for me. Okay, I managed to get the feather history and civilization. These are all of the all of the weapon of Nanashi Mumi. Um, I'm still missing the friend. Yeah, yeah. Now, basically, all of the Holocure character has a four specific types of weapons upgrades that they can use for their weapons. This one, Civilization, attack increased by 1% for every target currently on the screen, up to 100%. So if you have 100, per 100 enemies on your screen, then basically Nanashi Mume will increase his attack for about 100%. History for every 50 targets Mume has defeated increased damage by 1%. For now, I'll be going towards the history and let's focus on upgrading the passive first instead of getting new weapons. This will get a lot smooth, smoother after over, after putting an overlay for the Nvidia. By the way, I'm not sponsored. So for now, this is my, this is my second video. There will be a lot of upcoming follow-up video for Holo Live Cure. Holo Cure. Basically, I'm going to showcase every character clearing the stage mode. Doing a lot of contents for this game since this game really gives a ton of fun despite it being free to play so shout out for the creator of this game thank you very much for making a very fun game this time i managed to get the friend this is the friend that summons that uses one of your weapons but basically you only have one weapons bird feather so you're going to use so this will be very fun so basically nanachi mumi is a sh short range character you can see he does short range attacks doesn't reach the end of the screen but she does shine in the late game you may struggle playing her uh, during the early game since you need to point point and shoot and doing a lot of strafings but once you manage to awaken that weapon of hers and everything is already what they call this Everything will be easy as pie. 
since you'll see later once I manage to fully upgrade my weapon. For now let's go towards, ah, okay this one is probably good. I'm going for the face mask. Increase damage by 30%, take 30% take more damage. I don't care about the 30% more damage. But once I manage to unlock the awakened weapon of Mumei, I won't have trouble facing a lot of enemies. So once I manage to see the feather or any other passive items that I will be getting for the skill, I'll be picking those one up. And also, Mumi has a good panic button, wherein he can clear an entire screen of enemy on a press of a button, and there's a chance that your item will vanish. 30% chance is pretty high already. So let me showcase it. I'm using X, there we go. That's a mini jump scare. As you can see, the item there managed vanished, so I managed to use the benefit of the special skill. Some of these uh, enemies are already telegraphed, so you can already. I've already played quite a lot of them, so I know what time they will vanish and what time they will be spawning. Yep, the more enemies the shows, the more laggy it gets, the more FPS I get. FPS drop, not more FPS. For now, let's upgrade the bird feather for level 2. Bird feather, um, never mind. I'll go for the attack increase by 1% for every target. So, I finally got all of the passive weapon for my Nanashi Mumi. It's time to snowball from here. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna fast forward from here now on the 2 minute mark, so stay tuned and enjoy the montage.
I didn't manage to reach the boss, but as you can see, if I manage to do a lot of collapse items, then this probably this run probably will finish all of the enemies. Just focusing on solely on the Rika's uh, Mumei Feathers weapon. He can already last for about 19 minutes and 20 seconds. And if I didn't ne willy nilly use the, what they call this one, my special, then I could probably reach the boss. But if I manage to, you say, if I manage to do a collab weapon, then that's probably it. I could probably pass 25 or 23 minute marks, and that's basically it. Hopefully you like this kind of video, and of the, for the upcoming Holo Cure videos that I'm going to make, it will be a showcase of each character. But probably I'm gonna focus on unlocking some items on the shops. Probably gonna buy some upgrades before doing the showcase, since I'm still lacking quite a bit. And I know this video is very slow, but I managed to fast forward it for a bit, inducing the, edit, the power of the editing. And for now, I'll leave you with this. Let's pull, hopefully we managed to get the last member of the Holo Cure. Or hollow live. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Nanashi Mumei. Give me the last card. Okay, still no. I forgot that name. Anyway, this should be it for this video. Hopefully, you like it. And like, comment, subscribe. If you dislike the video, comment down below. And all of the links of for this video and my social links are located on my YouTube description. If you want to play this, this kind of game, then it's all on my YouTube description. You can click the link and download it. And hopefully, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!